Hi y'all, my name's Janice and I'm a junior on the Stanford women's tennis team. I'm currently checking in from my own makeshift wall in Houston, Texas. Hi Stanford fans, my name's Justin Kang. I'm a senior on the fencing team. I'm Josh Kang, I'm a freshman on the fencing team. And we're checking in from Fullerton, California. Hi hey guys, it's Karin Zanoli from Stanford women's field hockey checking in from right outside of Philadelphia. I'm a junior, I'm majoring in political science with minors in econ and art history. Hey Cardinal fans, Zach Gretsch here. Uh, pitcher for the Stanford baseball team. I'm checking in from Las Vegas where the temperature has been reaching the triple digits the last couple days. I'm definitely missing that beautiful Palo Alto weather. Hi everyone, my name is Nick Orr. I'm a fifth year senior on the baseball team and I'm a co-term student getting my master's in civil engineering uh, with a concentration in sustainable design and construction. I spend quite a lot of time up here. I'm in 20 units, which is five classes for me. So I'm on Zoom a lot or doing homework. Um, and I have a little calendar that keeps me organized with like the things that I do this week. And then every like Friday or Saturday, I'll update it. Since all the tennis courts are still pretty much closed around this area, I've had to make do with my own a makeshift wall. But outside of tennis, I've also tried to find other hobbies to keep myself busy. Um, one of those hobbies has been painting. I have painted um, a lighthouse and now I'm currently working on a second painting. So this is what I see on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, kind of keep track of what I need to do uh, up on that bulletin board right there. It looks like Bitcoin's up a little bit. Uh, when we first realized we'd be home for an extended period of time, it was a little difficult at first. We had to adjust to all these online classes and um, the thought of being away from our friends, coaches, and uh, teachers would be a little stressful at first. Wish we were on Sunken Diamond competing in front of you guys. We definitely all miss it. But as a baseball team, we've been keeping in touch, having some team Zoom meetings every once in a while, and definitely FaceTiming teammates and friends from school. And I encourage everyone else to do that, to def definitely stay in touch with your friends. All right, there's Belly, grinding on some grad school applications. This is where we work out. Got a couple of dumbbells out there, courtesy of Belly. So my brother and I spend pretty much all day in front of screens because of online classes. And my dad does because he's working from home and so does my mom. So we've been thinking about ways to connect offline um, and trying different things. And so my little brother earlier this week dug up his favorite board game, Settlers of Catan. And so we've been playing it every night after dinner and it's kind of a fun way to get the competitive juices flowing a little bit. Um, and it actually gets quite heated. So hopefully I win tonight, fingers crossed. We've been trying to take full advantage of uh, all the time we have on our hands. So lately the weather in LA has been really nice, it's been really hot, so we've been going on hikes and we've definitely been swimming a lot in our backyard. I've been getting to spend a lot of time with these two. Uh, this is Wrigley and this right here is the newest member of our family. Her name is Bailey. We got her about a week ago. Sometimes they'll watch lectures with me and they'll fall asleep, but we won't hold that against them. We have our home gym set up. Uh, so we've been doing some lifts given to us by Coach Tyler. And we've been doing some blade drills so we could uh, stay competitive in fencing. You know, we have to stay home. Can't really explore, can't really, you know, do the things that we normally do on a day-to-day -day basis. But I think that in itself um, is a really, really important thing to remember. And I think it's really uh, helpful for everyone to kind of have this feeling of camaraderie together, you know? I really miss being on campus. I miss seeing my teammates every day and actually getting to practice. Um, and I miss my friends and my roommate and just kind of everything that Stanford has to offer. Um, but you know, hopefully everybody is staying inside and staying safe and we can get back soon um, for the fall. It's obviously a really sad time for us as May would be our NCA season. Um, but we do know that we'll come back stronger next year and we're so excited to see what the future holds for this team. It's a really uncertain time for everyone. In that kind of sense of togetherness, let's focus on compassion. Let's reach out to our friends, keep in touch, foster the idea of you know, getting through this together. It's easier said than done, but we just won't be able to do this alone. We hope that everybody's staying safe and um, staying healthy too during these hard times. So, and hopefully we can all see you guys soon in the fall. I just want to give one great big shout out to all our essential personnel that are out there working. 
I am extremely grateful to have parents that are able to work and transition their work into online, into an online platform, but there are many families that aren't able to do that and there are people like medical care professionals, grocery store workers, mail carriers who have to continue going to work like normal when this is definitely not normal. This is still um, a, a pandemic at hand and that we still need to continue keeping up social distancing guidelines in order for us to return to any sense of normalcy and be able to return back on campus in the fall. Hopefully everyone's trying to stay positive like we are. I know it's difficult times, but we're all gonna get through it. Um, go Card. Thanks for checking in, Stanford. Stay safe, stay healthy. I hope everybody's staying safe and healthy and hopefully we'll all be back together on campus really soon. Go Card. <laughs>